are here at the Department of Mechanical Engineering where studies like automotive technology, aeronautics can be studied. I'm the project leader of the TUM Roborace team and I gathered together in total seven people, including me. The reason is that we wanted to have different backgrounds. In Season Alpha, we have different challenges ahead. Uh, one of the biggest challenge is the AI race, where two, three or four cars are racing against each other. So we had to develop software which is capable of overtaking, which is fast and which is reliable. I'm responsible for tire performance maximization. It's very important to have a, a real race car racing on a race track because then I can uh, yeah, get a lot of data, which wouldn't be possible with a road car. So for us, Roborace is a platform where we can test all our algorithm in a high performance environment. It's very difficult to get a prototype running at this level of performance and requires lots of work. So for us, it's really like a benefit to be able to test our algorithms there. And it's always a good chance to check where you are with respect to people working on the same topics. The Roborace Season Alpha is about where we test our algorithms and check their functionality and also have several opponents on a racetrack that we try to overtake during a race. So I guess there's a localization challenge. There will be an energy management challenge. Well, I hope that we can win all the competitions and the races against other participants. During my studies, I first started off with industrial robots and then later switched to mobile platforms like vehicles, artificial intelligence methods and stuff like that. So the larger part is work, but of course in the evening we have some fun too. I think I was interested in cars since I was very young. I was also interested in planes and stuff, but I think it's very important for testing our software on the real car and the real environment. Because it's, for example, the overtaking is quite hard to implement. There can appear a lot of situations you never think of in the beginning. My responsibility in the Rover Race team is the whole area of perception, so how the a vehicle knows what's its surrounding on the racetrack. We have several goals with this. The main focus for all of us, I think, is that we can test the software that we develop in our own speciality, that we can test it, bring it in the real life application and show that it really works, not just in simulation, but on a real car, on a real racetrack.